Welcome back to my channel. In this week's video, we are going to be finally getting back into some fashion videos. And specifically for today's video, we are going to be trying on bridal shower guest dresses. So I wanted to do something pretty specific. I feel as though you guys definitely like my fashion try on videos a lot. So I thought since bridal season and wedding season is coming up, but obviously I am not the one getting married, but I do actually have a wedding to attend. My cousin is getting married in June. I thought I would go ahead and take you guys along with trying on dresses for the events, but I have not seen a lot of girls doing videos specifically for bridal shower guest dresses. So if you are attending a bridal shower and you want some dress inspo, all of these dresses are under $100 and they are all from Amazon. So I will have them linked down below for you guys. We have five different dresses and really the occasion is nice casual. It's going to be a be down by the beach. So it's very beachy, nice casual, kind of like a, it's like a brunch kind of midday bridal shower so we want something light we want something flowy we want something springy beachy kind of you know a little bit more casual but still cute so that is what I've gone ahead and picked out for today's try on haul and yeah let's let's get right on into it shall we also quick side note before I put the dresses on I literally just got my hair done oh. <laughs> So if you see like red around, it's because I literally just got it done an hour ago. But yeah, we went for a cherry chocolate, very red undertoned, rich brunette, and I am obsessed. Can we just have a moment for the hair? Stunning. Alright you guys, we have dress number one. Yeah, where do I start? <laughs> I definitely wanted to start with the least appealing dress straight out of the package first. And this was definitely the one where I was a little bit more iffy when I came in the mail. One just mainly in the color i definitely thought it was going to be a little bit lighter than it actually is and the other thing is is that uh, this type of top like this shape the square with this really isn't very suitable on me but i loved the length of it i thought the little tiered ruffles going down was really pretty and still kind of nice and flowy very bridal shower kind of girly-esque and the main reason I went for gray even though it's liter literally spring is because I figured I wear a lot of gray and neutral colors and I could probably get more than one use out of it if I went for something like this. I could wear it throughout the summer or even into the fall maybe with something on top but it's definitely not giving what I wanted it to give. I would still give it like a 6 out of 10. It's just that everything from here up doesn't really suit me well, but the overall quality of the dress is nice. I like the length of it. I like the dress itself. It just doesn't really suit the occasion very well, but if you're looking for something like this, it, you may actually like it. Um, it's just not suitable for the occasion or for me. So, but of course, like I said, everything will be linked down below if you wanted to go ahead and try it out. So. But yeah, I'd probably give this like a 5 to 6 out of 10. So yeah, let's move on to the next dress. <laughs> Alright you guys, here is dress number two. We have a pop of color. One would call this, I guess, like maybe a cranberry or a fuchsia color. I thought I would try something different and I've come to notice that darker toned colors definitely suit me better instead of like pastel colors. So trying to still keep with the springy, more colorful things for the bridal shower while still staying within the color hues that match my skin tone and match my hair and everything as best as possible. 
So we're trying out this color. Honestly, I was a little worried that it was not gonna be right but i really like this color on me we have a little mushroom puff sleeve here you could wear it off the shoulder or on top it shows it online both ways you can really pick and choose if you wanted to cover up your shoulders you could totally just pick these up and you have maybe a little bit more coverage here also very cute this way as well love the flowiness same idea with this kind of squared neck what what is this? i feel like this was a big thing before like when I was a kid, this like ruffly, this like elastic stretch. I forget what this is called. But same idea as before with this upper part. I just feel like with a little sleeve, it definitely looks better on me. And then we have a midi length. I really usually never like midi length on me. It always makes me look short. It makes me look stout and just not cute. But this actually is not too bad. It's not a hard midi length it's definitely slightly lower than that it's right above the ankle which is nice so it's still modest and cute for a bridal shower very cute and definitely a little bit on the girlier side for me <laughs> um i really like it i really didn't think i was gonna like it i think i definitely like it more slightly off the shoulder and i just went ahead and paired it with a cute little gold vintage purse and my little gold and brown little slip-on kitten heels from Italy. I think it's really pretty. It's definitely a top contender. The next dress I'm about to show you guys is the exact same dress, just in a more indigo blue, in case I didn't really like this fuchsia pink. But I would give this a solid 7.5 out of 10. This is why that cubby of things keeps falling, because she keeps jumping into it. And if you watched my... Um, Catch all corner little DIY project video that I put out I think about two weeks ago She also did this so she keeps jumping in there. She really likes it. I'm just gonna leave it But yeah, so let's go ahead and try on the blue one and see which color we prefer you guys here is the blue and i definitely love the blue more the blue is definitely just more me than that fuchsia color i also noticed that on camera it definitely looks a lot more of a brighter fuchsia pink than it does in real life it is definitely darker in person a more muted toned fuchsia than it is on camera this blue though is stunning i almost don't even want to call it indigo blue it's more like a royal blue can you guys see luna right there she's just sit and chill and watch me it's like i have my own little audience it's amazing <laughs> i actually wanted to pair it with the exact same bag and shoes just to really see which would suit me better because i definitely would wear this bag and shoes with this style of dress i think it matches it really well and i think i love the blue and I honestly think I like the sleeves up more as well. It's really cute. It's giving cottage core. It's giving, uh, I don't know. Like, it's girly enough without being too girly. I love the sleeves. I love the cut. I love the flowiness. I love the little tiered ruffles. I love the length. I really do love this. Would I wear it for any other occasion besides this bridal shower? Probably not. Not that I can think of right off the top of my head because I'm not a casual dress wearer. I feel like for a lot of girls you could easily, they would probably just wear this out for like lunch or something or going out just casually with some sneakers. I would not. That's just not me. But I really like it and it can't hurt to have as a backup just because god forbid something happens her wedding colors are blue and yellow so i could always last minute change and wear this to the wedding if need be so it's a great backup dress as well just in case but this one's definitely my favorite so far but let's go ahead and move on i have two more dresses both are more of a neutral color as well so and they're completely different styled so let's go ahead and get on with the next dress You guys, I'm dead. I was not expecting this gorgeousness from this dress. You guys, look at this Amazon dress. Are you kidding? 
Are you kidding me? I, it's so flattering. I look snatched. The shape is gorgeous. The sleeves sit perfectly. Everything about this dress is stunning. It has the slightest little slit at the bottom here. It has a nice v-neck to kind of spice up the dress since it's very simple. I love the full length of it. I just paired it with some simple slide-on cute little sandals, some cream ones. Just because, obviously, for the bridal shower, I feel like this is very fancy. I love it. I absolutely love it. It is so stunning. So stunning. I was even thinking of pairing it with this bag. This dress is stunning. I, I have to keep this dress. This dress I would wear somewhere. Like, this is so cute. Like, maybe if me and Anthony go out to dinner or something in the summer. Like, this dress is so beautiful. Oh, my gosh. I can't get over it. Like, honestly, this is so cute it definitely like snatches in at the most perfect spot possible it looks a little weird on the hanger i'm not gonna lie i was like ooh, that looks weird like not what the picture looks like but it is so beautiful there's no zippers or buttons or anything on any of these dresses you guys these are all slip on it's stretchy it is so comfortable and on top because it's a june slash april very like warmer weather type events this material is super lightweight so it's not heavy it's not gonna make you sweat i have no complaints about this dress other than the fact that it is a navy blue dress so it's definitely a darker color wouldn't mind going online and getting it in another color to better match the season because this is just absolutely stunning i'm gonna give it a nine out of ten i'm gonna give it a nine out of ten i love it like it's so beautiful when it comes to dresses, let me just say really quickly, I get very insecure very easily. That's why I'm not a normal casual dress wearer, like I was saying before, and this I feel amazing in. So if you are also someone who's a little bit more insecure while wearing a dress because they just don't fit you right or they don't really look right on you and they're not comfortable, this dress is stunning. I will have it linked down in the description box below beautiful, especially for people who are insecure about their arms like I am this little capped sleeve little short sleeve moment so cute i can't you guys anthony actually just pulled up to my house so i'm gonna get his reaction for you guys on camera let's see what happens i think this would be so fun and funny i don't know why but okay let, let's <laughs> you look gorgeous <laughs> All right, you guys, and here is the final dress. We have the exact same dress as the one before, but in a long sleeve and this kind of champagne brown color. I really like the style of the long sleeve. It is beautiful. It's very elegant, but still simple and chic. Love everything about it. Again, the length and the slit, everything is basically the exact same. I'm just unsure if this color suits me well. I feel like it may wash me out. It's definitely not the kind of brown that I thought it was going to be. But again, same as that navy blue one. I love this style of dress and the material and everything about it so much that I definitely would just exchange it for another color. The only problem was is that certain colors came like at the end of April, which really wouldn't work for the bridal shower, seeming that it's next weekend. But there are so many colors, you guys, online for all of these dresses. So if you like to the style and you like the shape and the length, but you didn't like the color, go ahead and look anyway because there are a ton of different colors in every single one of these dresses. So if you want to find something that better suits you i'd go ahead and look anyway down in the description box but i want to say i think the dress number four was definitely my favorite i'd give this one solely an eight out of ten just because of the color so beautiful and stunning almost even too fancy for a bridal shower but Obviously, every bridal shower is different. Maybe if you have a little bit more of a formal, maybe you guys are going to a restaurant type of bridal shower, this is, dress is definitely a little bit better for that occasion. Overall, you guys, I think we have a winner, and I think it's going to be that navy blue short sleeve dress for the bridal shower because that one is just stunning and gorgeous, and I'll, I'll probably wear it exactly the way that I showed you guys. And yeah, I am really happy with the results of this try-on.
All right, you guys, those are all of the dresses that I have for you today. I really hope you got some inspo for if you are going to a bridal shower coming up. If you did and you liked this video, make sure to give it a thumbs up so that I know. Again, all the dresses will be linked down in the description box for you guys. So you can easily go ahead and shop if you want. If you like these videos as well, make sure to comment down below. Also, letting me know which dress was your favorite because I'm indecisive and I need a few people's just, you know, point of views, their thoughts, their opinions. So please let me know down below which dress was your favorite. One, two, three four or five thank you guys so much for watching all the way to the end i really appreciate it and i will see you guys next week love you bye